Hey guys, I decided to pop in while I'm cooking dinner, just do a quick video. I've been getting a lot of messages, people asking me how I'm doing because I shut down my Instagram page on January 1st. And although I had walked away from Facebook 2020, November of 2020, I had kept it up in case people wanted to grab some of my old research and I would pop in from time to time um, from my browser. And so that I formally deleted on January 1st too. I'm still... On Telegram, I have my website, EvetteBronx.org. I still have content that I want to put out. So I haven't completely gone on the ground, but I did really want to get ground to get back um, present in real life. I just had coffee and Bible study with a good friend. You know, things like that feel good. I have all this zucchini here um, and I'm planning to make a lot, a lot of bread <laughs> to freeze and store and have ready. Um, my son gave me an instant pot for Christmas and I made bulk beans, Puerto Rican style that we have ready to go. You know, these are the things that I wanted to do that I had put aside because I was busy trying to wake people up. You know, I had spent so much time trying to stop what's occurring and you know i don't feel bad stepping away now because i've done it all i spoke in front of the epa in front of congress school boards board of supervisors um you know i organized boot camps and classes and rallies and walks and i've done it all so you know I know that we are nine tenths into the global takeover. The technocracy is here. Blockchain is going to be the way that they try to enslave us. You know, this metaverse mixed virtual realities, how the enemy is going to try to infiltrate our souls, our minds, um, especially that of our children. So it's very important that we're present, that we're in the word, that we have our families grounded. And so I just wanted to tell you that I'm doing great. And yes, I'll eventually do my classes again and put out some content, but it's time for everyone to get back to real life. Tie those loose ends, you know, prep your home, go do fun things, um, you know, get in shape, take care of your health, um, get out of the beast system. And really the most important thing is get with God and and learn who he is and have a true relationship with him because this is not our world. There's no saving the Republic, but we can save souls for the kingdom. And so that's what I'm trying to do. Be grounded, um, working on my family and my marriage and myself, you know, we're all sinners and we could do better. And so I just wanted to pop in and say, I'm doing really good. Um, you know, I have my Lyme flare ups, but I'm working on my health. I'm working on my family, working on my home, and I will be putting out new content eventually, but I just needed this time and this reprieve. And, um, I hope that I'm setting a good example. You step, step away from it too. You know, if there are people you need to forgive, forgive them. If you need to ask for forgiveness, ask for forgiveness, make things right. Life is short. We don't know when we're going to die. We don't know when our savior is coming back. Let us prepare ourselves in just the right way. Our souls, our homes, our children, and, um, you know, repair those relationships. So have a great day. Peace.